Hi guys, my name is Megan. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make a really simple sugar salt scrub. These are just so easy to make and they're so nourishing and moisturizing for your skin and they exfoliate all the, the dead skin off and then they moisturize after that. So this is just really, really great and I love having a little bit of this on hand. And these make amazing gifts as well if you have some people that you're just not really sure what to get for them. You could make them a little jar of sugar salt scrub and a little beeswax candle up a little handmade gifts and put it in a basket and make it look pretty and it's just really simple and easy and then you have your gifts taken care of but this is just a really easy recipe you can basically memorize it in like a minute <laughs> so let's just get right into this so the ingredients that we'll need is sugar I have some organic cane sugar here it doesn't have to be too fancy or expensive you can even use brown sugar if you don't have white sugar on hand it can just be Whatever kind of sugar that you have, you can do a combination of white sugar and brown sugar. I'm just gonna do all of it as my white organic cane sugar. And then you need salt. You can either use white table salt or something like pink Himalayan salt. This is probably ideal just because it has so many great minerals that are really good for your skin. I'm getting a little bit low on this, so I'm just gonna use the table salt today. You need some coconut oil. It's easier if you use melted coconut oil. Mine is actually just kind of melty all the time because I just happen to store it in a little heat pocket in our house apparently. So it's kind of always melted which is really handy. But you can just melt it on the stove if yours isn't already melted and it makes it way easier to combine. Or you, if you don't have coconut oil you can use something like olive oil or almond oil. And then you need essential oils and that is all. So this recipe is so easy to remember because we're doing equal parts of the sugar, the salt, and the coconut oil. So I'm going to do half a cup of the sugar, half a cup of salt, and half a cup of coconut oil. And then for the essential oils, do 20 to 30 drops of just any essential oil of your choice, just whatever sounds good to you. Today I'm going to do lavender and orange essential oils because that is my favorite blend almost all year. I love lavender and orange together. If you want more ideas for blends, go over to my bath salts video and I talk about several different blends. One's really great for clearing your mind, one's a great stress reliever, there's one that is great for soothing sore muscles, and then the last one is for clearing your sinuses. So if you need some more ideas just go over to that video, I'll link it below for you guys. But just any essential oils you want, just have them equal around 20 to 30 drops. You don't have to be too particular. I'm going to do 15 drops of lavender and I'm going to do 10 drops of orange today. And then just stir up all your ingredients. I store mine in mason jars and then you're done and this is going to be so nourishing and moisturizing for your skin or make a great Christmas or birthday gift it smells amazing so I hope this video was helpful it was just nice and short it's just such a simple recipe I almost feel funny making a video about it but hopefully it was helpful for you guys and you guys enjoy making this as much as I do thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video bye